I went to Michael's this morning and I picked up this 24 piece Artist Loft watercolor pencil set and I'm excited to try these out. I only paid $1.07 for them. Um, they do retail for $5.99. Pretty self-explanatory. So we're gonna go ahead and go at it. Start out, there are 24 of these pencils, um, which is a pretty good number for $5.99. Um, I'm having to redo this, that's why they all look used. But um, basically I dipped them in water and this happened with the little um, wear down of the pencils. So you can tell they're kind of soft, um, but I have not used them at all yet. So this is my real first impression of these Artist Loft 24 set watercolor pencils that you can use dry and wet. So we're just gonna start off and I'm going to put the names of all the colors in the um, side view or something. So this is a pink, but it doesn't look pink dry. So I'm interested to see if this actually looks pink dry or if it looks red because it looks red on paper. So now obviously I'm trying the pencils wet. Um, I'm just dipping them into water. It's taken me like 20 times, so I'm gonna speed this up and probably not show the rest of it. Um, because honestly, it's taken way too long and it's annoying as hell. So yeah. This is what they look like wet. I felt like I had to use an unnecessary amount of water to even get them to work. I mean, they're kind of patchy and blotchy and I literally had to dip in the water about 20 times per pencil to even get them to blend and not look dry like these. I will say the colors when wet are more vibrant. Um, I'm gonna try it with a brush as well. I'm thinking I might try it with a watercolor brush and see if taking the color straight from the pencil and depositing it onto the brush works better than, let's say, wetting the brush, dipping it in 20 times to get the one little spot you want to do vibrant enough. So um, I'm going to wait on this and I'm going to do maybe just like a few colors with the brush down here. That is so much better and see it blends seamlessly if you do it with a brush, which I know is kind of not the point of getting watercolor pencils. 
Oh wow. See, so much better. And literally you can keep on going and it just fades away into a little light blue. I really just suggest if you're gonna use them as actual watercolor pencils, get get the brush, get, get the color off the pencil. It looks so much better. I mean, no one wants harsh lines when watercoloring. Look at these, these are just seamless and so pretty. And these are harsh and ugly. But this is what the dry looks like. You can also use them as regular colored pencils, or you can also use them as water pencils, um, which I suggest not doing. I would just suggest getting a brush and taking the color off, as I said. But yeah, I hope you have a nice day. Um, comment, like, and subscribe. Bye.